All right, what's up? So today we're gonna to go through how to use this tripod. It's a very nice tripod that we have. I think a lot of people don't even know that we have it, but if you're going to take like still photos of somebody or you know, you're getting a bunch of like the fashion spread, I think that would be a good use, something like that, where you're getting multiple of like kind of the same picture. It's a tripod we use for like the staff pictures that are going to the call phone. So we're gonna go through how to use it and how to put it together. All right, so you're gonna open this bad boy up. Um, take it out of there and it's in this very nice case right here so we're going to take the case open it up and take it out carefully and then from there open up the legs and then you can these like flip open and they can lengthen close it to lock them and you're going to do that on every side um, and you can, I mean, with that, they're completely adjustable. So if you need it to be a shorter length or, you know, taller length, you can obviously do that. All right, so you're gonna take a camera. It's got this little thing at the bottom here where you can screw it in right on the tripod. So whether you wanna like turn the camera around if you feel comfortable enough, or if you wanna like hold the camera and twist the tripod, I'm just gonna twist it on top because I feel like I have a pretty good handle on it. But obviously you wanna be very careful when you're doing this because you have a nice camera and it's, you know, four or five feet up in the air and you don't want to drop it on the ground. But it's, you're going to twist it up until it gets pretty tight. You don't want to over twist it because then you start like messing with it. But once it feels pretty solid on there, that's it. You know, you can start your camera and start shooting and do whatever you need to do. Solid, you can still change it, um, change the heights and different things. Um, and that's that. Exactly what you did to start, you're going to loosen those things and bring them back in. Um, this is important, obviously you can't just leave it up like this because it's not going to fit in the bag. But we're going to put those back in and then just make sure the legs go in all the way. And that's pretty much it. Uh, you're going to take it and put it back in the bag how you found it. Make sure it's nice in there and zip it up nicely. That way, because this case is very protective, it's thick, it's got some cushioning in there so it doesn't break. And then you're going to put it back in the box. Large, but it should go right in there. Make sure it's all tucked in there nice. And you're gonna close it exactly the way you found it. Kind of latching it up. Um, put it in there, make sure that that's closed. That way it won't break. Um, and we'll take it back to where it's supposed to go. So it is right in between the two camera cabinets back in the lab. You're gonna take it and it just kind of sits right in the middle. Those fit perfectly right there. And uh, that's how you use the tripod.